Hello, my name's Harry Double A. Uh, here we are in the south of Italy, Formia, UK warm weather training camp. Here with my training partner, James D. Hi. Hi. Um, I'm going to be your host for the afternoon, unfortunately, so you've got to deal with me, but we're on our way to the track now. Second session of the day, so you've missed the first one, unfortunately. Yeah. We're about to walk into the um, Italian Olympic complex. This is where all the Italians do their training. You know, got a nice view up there, up there. A little bit of a mountain cliff up there. Um, majority of athletes, so you know you've got amazing athletes that train here. Lainis and Baeva. Obviously, all us Brits come down here. You got the Polish teams, you got Finnish teams. So. They normally stay in these accommodation. My favourite one here is on the left. Any one of these I'll have in a day. Okay guys, we're at the track now. Perfect Mondo, bit old, but it's amazing. James, how do you like the Mondo? It's fast, fast, really fast. So Larry, how are you doing today? I'm good man. Come on man, tell us what your, what's, your, what's your fuse about the camp? Come Warm on, you're talking training, to UK so now. Here. You're talking good. to UK, so put on your proper good. voice, you know. Hopefully, um, with all the kind of training we're doing here, it will result in loads of gold medals. Larry, tell us something interesting. Anything, random. I think this will be the best year for UK athletes ever. Yeah? We're all going to be firing on all guns blazing. We've got our sprinters all back in shape. We're getting there. We've got our jumpers all ready to go. Here in Formula, we've got all sorts of athletes around the world training. Um, currently, like I said, me and James are about to begin the triple S session. Here we have some um, Danish athletes training, Polish athletes training, all from around the world. I'm just give you a little view of some of the facilities we have to deal with here. Some more where the gymnasts have <laughs> got a nice little wave over there. Some gymnast, um, gymnastic equipment mainly. Um, so, like I said, the likes of Yelena will regularly do her sessions here. This is how we do our conditioning, man. Yeah, we're. Sure, just, I thought you got Harry, man. Just finished finished doing a session, but you know, just as a little treat for you guys, gonna show you a couple tricks. Um, complimentary of uh, UK, if you can do these things at home, you win a Alfa Romeo Mito. So, um, you know, first we have the press up clap, press up challenge. If you might have, um, if anyone hurts them, hurts themselves, we're not <laughs> we're not taking <laughs> we're taking responsibility for anything. <sighs> I thought you got double A. So, you know, you know you got the you got the usual press up clap. So you got the usual press up clap. Here you go. We're gonna do it like this. You got two claps. You got three. <laughs> so, I'm talking about. That, that's 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 the press up clap. All right. So you just seen me do the press up clap, and yes, I did clap in front, clap behind, and then clap in front again. Did you hear that? That was three claps. Three claps around the body. All right now, I'm gonna show you candlestick. My favourite exercises. You now we try not to work the upper body. It's all about that abs. Get abs like JD and you'll be good to go. So you get into the position. Nice little rack in front of you, above you. Legs up. And you're slowly going to go down. Go down. Bring it back up. Back up. Good. Do about five. Go through a series. Three sets of five. You know, it's hard work we do out here in Formula. UK, UK training camp. Back to you, James. Peace out. They needed a spark, so they sent for the wise men. You can see through the dark that the temperatures rise. It goes, you can't touch. Then you have the pole. It's warm. It tends to be warm the majority of the time. Especially if you come out of where Miss Louise Hazel is. How is the ice bath today? It's freezing. It's freezing. Yeah, I'm trying to win a bear. So tell us, what is the purpose of doing this? Ice bath or contrast bathing is excellent for recovery. So you would go from there to... Yeah, to the hot pool. And how long or how many times would you do this for? I tend to do it probably five times. So five cold, five warm, yeah. for about ten minutes. And here she's moving, she's moving. Let's catch it, let's catch the movement. Not with a bomb, not with a bomb. <laughs> Don't really kick me out one. <laughs> okay, let's, 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 let's get some questions going. So, 
with um, your nice swimming action. Tell us how you like Formula. It's great. It's an excellent facility. Yeah. The coach is first class. Yeah. It's great for an athlete like myself because I've been able to work with coaches that I wouldn't normally have access to. And, um, you know, the pasta does get a bit repetitive. <laughs> but at the end of the day, beach training in England, we've got excellent weather at the moment. I would have been able to put the finishing touches on our competition preparation. Perfect. So how's training been going anyway? This is my Halle Berry bit, Harry. Your Halle Berry getting out of a pool, Bond girl, that is that. Anyone impressed you so far? Harry AA yeah, yeah, seems to do alright. Uh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> yes, we can have a joke and a laugh here. <laughs> Charles, I'm going to ask you a few random questions now. Random. What would be one of your favourite songs at the current moment? What does next, Charles listen next to? Question. Next question. <laughs> Charles does not listen to music. <laughs> Charles only listened to the music of the 70s. He's the a yesterday 70. man. Hey, that, that is fine by us. Um, now, let's, okay, let's talk cars. What would be your top be, five? I tell you what. I've been in California for a few days, and the best thing about California is the, is the music channels. They have, like, five channels there, back-to-back, -back, on the music of the 70s. And that is you. That's me. All day long. So That's me. we now know that Charles is still living in the 70s. Yes. Music, in yeah, music terms. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> That's the time when they made real music. Real music? Go okay, on. okay. Next question. <laughs> Next question. Um, what would be your favourite events? Oh. In athletics? Hmm. Um, heptathlon. Okay. 110 hurdles. Okay. Because of the spectacle. The, you know, mature men with high hurdles and make a lot of noise. I like that. I like javelin. A lot okay, that's good. Because, um, you know, it's impressive the, the, from, from when, you, when you're there, you see how far it flies. Um, pole vault. And um, how many more? Uh, four, I, I think I, you've I done four. Five. I, I need, think I one, more, five. One, one more, one more, one more. One more, the 10 kilometers man at World Championships or Olympic Games. Oh, what, what, Because what? that's one big sprint. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. Then I, 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 I almost feel African. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Awesome, Charles. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah.